Blimey, where did all this come from? Well, it was a police box, wasn't it? I what are you both doing in here? You dropped your keys. How dare you follow me into the TARDIS? The what? The TARDIS, sir. This is a vessel for travelling through time and space. Why did you follow me? I'm, I'm terribly sorry if, if we've annoyed you, Doctor. It was my fault, I'm afraid. Who was all this, I stand back from those controls. Those controls are used for dematerialising. Dematerialising? What does that mean? You and this young lady are experiencing it. You are now travelling through time and space. Yeah, well, uh, make sure I get back by tea time, Doctor. I've got to get back to my ship by the night. Young man, it's going to be a long time before you see your ship again. Eh? Why? When are we going to land? I don't know. And that's the cause of half my trouble through my journeys. I never know. Why not? I have no control over where I land. Neither can I choose the period in which I land in. Oh. Now, you see that scanner? That is what I call the scanner up there. We get a very good view from the outside. Yes, I think we've landed in some sort of caves. Yeah, well, thanks for the young movies, Doctor. Now, if you just open these Wait, doors... wait, wait, young man. We don't know where we are. We don't know if it's safe or what period we're in. Well, look, I'll take a little bet with you, eh? London, 1966, Fitzroy Square. Yes, I think it's quite normal. Yes, the temperature's all right. Well, I think you can leave, but watch your step. Oh, it's a relief. You have me nervous for a minute, Doctor. Come on, then. Oh, dear, all this distraction. And I really thought I was going to be alone again. 